going to be showing you the glove stitch. It's used for sewing two pieces of fabric together and as the name suggests it was used to make gloves in the past. So I have a line marked and I do have two pieces of fabric here I'm sewing together. I'm going to start by bringing my needle out on the line. So I actually put my knot between the two layers. Then I'm going to take my thread up and over the edge of the fabric, bring my needle back through in the same point where I came out to start with. Then I am going to go over a bit and I'm going to bring my needle out on the line. So what I'm doing is making an angled stitch here we go and then I'm going to go up and over the edge of the fabric again and came come out on that same point just like I did the first time and then I'm going to go over to the right bring my my thread up and over the edge of the fabric bring it out on the line then I'm going to go up and over the edge of the fabric again and come out in the same spot as I did on the line. And then I'm going to go over to the right again, so that's making my diagonal stitch. Then I'm going to go up and over the edge of the fabric, come out in the same point. So I'm coming out in that point twice every single time. And then over to the right. Up and over the edge of the fabric, come out on the same point. So I'm always wrapping the thread over the edge of the fabric. It's basically making a zigzag up there. To the right. So I make a vertical stitch and a diagonal stitch same point. That one should be straight up. And whenever I'm ready to end, I want to end on a vertical stitch. So I'm going to take that to the back. And when I look at the back, the back is basically just double vertical stitches. and I would tie it off. Now I did use it and you're going to just pretty much have to take my word for it to sew my little emery squares to the ribbon and I did use uh, matching thread so it kind of just disappears but it's a pretty uh, strong stitch too basically because we're going double and it's zigzag. So it's a nice one for joining fabric together and it could also be a decorative Though I think I would need to work on it a little bit more to make it look prettier than that if I wanted contrasting thread.